Hey guys, so something big happened this morning. I took my clinic exit exam. I cannot believe it, oh my gosh. So I remember back when I had to take clinic entry exam and that one was nerve wracking, but turned out to be not so bad. And if you guys don't remember from my previous videos, clinic entry exam is what you have to take before you can be a student clinician seeing patients as a third year. And then clinic exit exam is something that you have to take before you can graduate. There are four cases. There's an emergency case, acute, ethical, and a delivering bad news case. And for each case, there's a proctor. So I already have a lot of test anxiety. And then to be tested live in front of a proctor who is a licensed naturopathic doctor with a whole bunch of experience and knows so much more, it was so nerve wracking. But on top of that, they also filmed us. And they didn't tell us this beforehand. They just told us right before we were about to go in. They're like, by the way, we're going to film you. There's a camera in there. And I was like, how can they do that? Oh my gosh, I thought I was gonna have a heart attack. Ugh, it was so nerve wracking. So with my luck, I had the delivering bad news case first. And I was so terrified because it was such a heavy topic. It's never easy to deliver bad news. I've never had to do it in the clinic yet, but I had to give results of an MRI. I go in and this is a standardized patient. So she's not a real patient, but she's an actress. And she's a very good actress because after I delivered the news, she was in shock and she started crying. And then I was like, oh my God, what do I do? Where are the tissues? I don't know how to handle this. I don't know what to say. And it was just a very heavy, Oof, discussion that I had to have with her, but I made it and in a way I was kind of glad that that was my first one because Delivering bad news was way harder than I thought it was gonna be I was really concerned about the ethical case and the acute scenario But it turns out that the ethical case wasn't that bad by the way We did not have to perform any physical exams So what we did was if we wanted to perform an exam and get the results We just told the proctor like hey I want to do a cardio exam a lung exam and then any labs or imaging that we wanted to order We just told them to and they told us the results and then afterwards the standard Standardized patients gave us feedback, which I had pretty decent feedback for the most part. Um, everyone said I was really friendly and I had a warmth <laughs> to me and my smile was nice. So that was nice. It made me feel good. Um, and then there was a little bit of constructive criticism too, which I appreciate, but you know, getting feedback is hard, but it's okay. You live and you learn. And this whole process was really good assessment, in my opinion, of how much I've learned and how much I actually do know, because I was very surprised in the emergency situation. I was like, okay, the patient's presenting with this and this. And then I was like, all right, we got to order this, this, this. Like I was very on top of it, which surprised me because I was like, whoa, Where's this coming from? Because like thinking about it, I was getting freaked out. I was like, oh my gosh, what if I can't remember what to order? What if I can't remember what the results show or mean? But anyways, it's over now. And for each case, we need to have at least an 80%. Otherwise, we have to retake the cases. And I do not want to retake any. I just want to be done with it and just focus on graduating now and <laughs> taking boards because I have to start prepping for that soon. I will probably post or an update you guys about my results on Instagram. So if you don't follow me already, my account is marilyn.marola. Feel free to connect with me. I love talking to you guys. If you have any questions, you can also reach out to me on there. But as always, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up below. And if you have any questions or comments, go ahead and leave them down below as well. Bye.